Hey, it's Ali from aharm.co.uk. I got a special video for you this time. It's a little secret that I'm gonna let you know. So I found out that you can get Tidal for a super cheap price. And I'm not talking about the lowest end Tidal. I'm talking about the highest end master quality, the, you know, the best possible quality that you can get from Tidal. You can get it for a really cheap price. So for us Brits over here, you can get the equivalent of 139 pesos, which works out to be about just under two pounds. Now for you American folk, that'll be around $250, something like that. But nonetheless, it's the highest quality title and you can get it for a super cheap price. Now, watch the rest of this video and I'll show you exactly how you can do it. It's super easy, you'll love it, and you won't believe that it can actually work. Let's check it out. Before I show you how to get the super cheap Tidal subscription, let's have a quick look at some of the apps. So this one is for the Android TV and you can see how well it's laid out. It looks really good. The app supports the well-loved material design and the lean back for the Android TV interface. And it's really easy to navigate and find music you want to play. The player allows you to change the quality of the music. I keep it on master, but if you want to change it to something else, you can. The interface is the same on the Amazon Fire TV. The desktop app looks very familiar and that's a good thing. It looks pretty much just like Spotify. Everything's laid out as you'd expect. It's nice and easy with beautiful thumbnails showing you the albums of the artists that you want to listen to. I can't really fault the interface. It does everything you want. You can easily find new music and you can also browse your own library. Player controls are both supported on Mac OS and Windows 10, so you don't have to worry about that. Tidal also allows you to watch music videos. All right, let's jump in and I'll show you exactly how you can get the cheap Tidal subscription. You're gonna need a VPN. I recommend NordVPN not only because it's cheap, but it also allows you to bypass Netflix country restrictions. If you don't want it for that, you just need to get the one month plan. I'll leave affiliate links in the description and in the article. You don't have to use the links, but it'll be helpful to this channel if you do. Once you're all signed up, you need to go ahead and download the NordVPN app. I'm on a Mac OS, so I'm going to get it from the App Store. Luckily, NordVPN supports multiple platforms, Windows 10, Android, iOS, pretty much every major platform. Once NordVPN is installed, open it up and then you need to log in. Use the credentials that you set when you first signed up. On the left hand side, you'll see a country list. The country we need is Argentina. Argentina will allow us to have super cheap subscription plans with Tidal. If all goes well, it should say that you're protected by a VPN in Argentina. Now we're ready for the next step. Easy as pie. Open up a browser and go straight to Tidal.com. T-I-D-A-L.com. This method should work if you already have a Tidal account, as long as it doesn't have an active subscription. If you do have an account, log in now as you normally would, and then follow the next step. If you don't have an account, click on start free trial. What you gotta do now is create a new account with the email or one of the other options. Once your account's created, you should be greeted with the price plans. Now don't be scared of the large numbers. I'll show you what these actually translate to in a second. All right, so you've got two options, premium or hi-fi. I would go for a hi-fi myself because you get lossless, beautiful quality sound. But if you're not bothered by that, then go for the premium version. Now there is a third option. You can go for a family package and it's going to be a killer price, no matter which option you choose. It's probably a good idea to go ahead and get this now before Tidal figures out how to fix this loophole. The premium plan works out to be just over a dollar and under a pound. The family version will cost you just over a dollar and just over a pound. The hi-fi plan will cost you around two dollars and just under two pounds. The family version of that will cost you three dollars and just under three pounds. And that's it. Now you've got super cheap 
title subscription, hi-fi or premium, family plan, whichever you chose, you can enjoy it now. But if you've just moved over from a different music streaming service, then this bit is for you. So there's an app called Soundees, which allows you to transfer your library from one platform to another. I've used it to move my massive Spotify library to Tidal, and I haven't looked back since. They do charge £4.50 per month, but you only need it once. After that, I would just cancel it. After you signed up, go to platform to platform so you can transfer your music from one to another. Find the service that you used to use, let's say Spotify, and then choose Tidal on the next step. And then what you can do is choose all the playlists you want to move across from one platform. You've got granular control, so you don't need to move the unwanted music at all or simply move all of your music all at once. And that's it, now you can enjoy Tidal. One last thing, ahan.co.uk is now available on Google News. So make sure you follow us, you can then get quick access to all of our articles and every single one of our videos, and even the new download section. This is the quickest way to get to our new content. So make sure you follow us now, I'll leave the link in the description. Take it easy and remember, stay safe.